It's important for me to try and involve some sustainability into the shows because I innately have a huge carbon footprint comparative to maybe any other individuals who come to the show. And when you're on the road all the time and constantly on the move, you just see your output a lot more clearly. And so to kind of do responsible touring and to at least try and mitigate some of the pressures that you might be putting on um, you know, environmentally with all these flights, with all this driving, at least to be able to bring people to new information about how they can you know, uh, act more responsibly as an individual environmentally, or whether that's through, yeah, through the songs or through people who are much more informed than I am. It's just about, I think, why not for me? I've very much cared about it for a long time before music, and so that's, uh, as soon as I've started doing music, it still matters. You can do it by making sure that if you have to have disposable cups that are made from like a corn-based plastic, for example, like bio cups, we ask the venues to be straw-free, uh, for the evening, which just that those two things alone are a step forward, um, a, a massive step forward in the output, particularly if they instill the idea in the venue, which they have on this tour. People don't innately come to a show and just think it's a bad thing to take a plastic cup and get water. I would, I would do just the same. So that's where I think that once you at least open up the idea to people and communicate about it on stage or through our event pages, they're usually just really excited, um, usually really excited that, oh, okay, I didn't know that. And they probably, from, from my experience at least, when now they're gonna see a bio cup in another venue or in another bar and they're going to they're going to notice that, whereas prior they might not have. So it's just been a great point of learning for everybody, us as the team that's kind of trying to put it forward, the venues, for the attendees. It's a, it's a really awesome opportunity to learn about how you can make these small changes with these different products and just have, or make one decision to be, you know, not have straws on the night and how much of an impact that can have.